My name is Mithun Ramdharne. I was a teacher until glaucoma took my eyesight away. I still remember the day when Milin and Sudarshan visited me for a cup of tea. They say life is better when you're laughing until Milin asked me the most intriguing question. He said, "What if at this present moment you get your eyesight back? What is the first thing you want yourself to see?" school my school the view of the school's building and the enormous ground was the first image my brain projected but my reality followed me in my imagination until i saw myself from fourth standard in that red combination of shirts and shorts with that innocent smile my mind finds and sorts Memories just keep ringing bells and school's excitement filled my blood stream like a fever of good vibes ringing back to my mind. I still remember the yoga day celebration which was more of a spiritual experience where all senior students actively participated. But my version from 4th standard was still lost in that playful time where lawn's green color made us feel friendly. You see choosing an odd color was something I was good at but my performance excelled high in our drawing competition At that time we didn't care about the mismatch of colors and patterns in life although the feeling of participation was enough for me to colorize my shades with energy in my school life The fun fair was next. Where the social gathering was primary and students justified fair attention to all the fun being catered and displayed in the best possible way. So my reality of blindness was following me in my imagination but the fun i had made my blind sight visualize all the small details progressing ahead to 7th standard i still remember vishaka teacher's maths lecture where she gave us a simple math equation to solve within 5 minutes even after being taught by the best teacher of our school i was the odd man out in maths but the best man in performing and celebrative arts
Though my school was small in physical structure compared to all the convent schools around, but it had the most strongest spirit of life that motivation was the key to charge any student and ignite the spark within. Transitioning to the last year of the school, the best part was to announce sports lecture being confirmed. Our school paid special attention to all activities including sports and festival celebration. I still remember the day when we had a special dedicated time allocated for our science exhibition where each year I always had higher expectations to see something innovative and different. The most important chapter was the Teachers' Day celebration. I was very nervous to face this situation because we students from 10th standard are supposed to teach the younger students in a way to celebrate the occasion of Teachers' Day. It was that first moment I realized there is something rare about teaching that attracts my mind. I had to overcome my fear because I was supposed to teach algebra and maths was my weakest side. I somehow managed to start with high confidence and the art of teaching made me realize my real purpose of life. But sometimes Life gives you some uneven circumstances, something which would set you off track, something which would drag you down, break you, make you regret every decision you take. What you can do is just run and hide. But somehow you cannot seek out the brightest light. For me, everything that had colors in life was turning out black on one side and only memories were left that would colorize my mind on the other side. Black was the only answer to my eyesight. Today, my school completed 25 years and I'm here back with my damaged eyesight for an interview in hope that my school selects me and helps me resume my teaching as they helped me few years ago realize my real purpose of life.